three, two, one. Hello, friends. It is Super Two Center here, bringing you another gameplay and commentary of not FIFA 12 this time of Modern Warfare 3. Yeah, I'm just gonna say it right now, guys. This game is a lot of fun for Call of Duty players to like playing Call of Duty. It is a lot of fun. Uh, I went to the midnight release. It was great. Got a free poster, got two free magnets, because me and my brother went, got two free magnets, and there's a gamer truck, uh, it was great, there was Model for two in it, it was a tournament, so it, it was, it was okay, I didn't participate, funny story, true story, um, so you have to register on, like, you have to call them ahead of time, so you could participate in this tournament at GameStop, and, me and my brother were like, no, I don't think we're going to handle this because we might get fucking torn apart. Or they're going to rip a new one on us. <laughs> and so, we didn't enter. And then luckily in that midnight release, we were right there just sitting down. And there was a bunch of other people. And this lady was just asking around saying, hey, we got a few free open spots. Do you guys want some? Me and my brother, like, talked about it. And then I was like, sure, I'll go for it. So I went for it. And she like, said a number between... One and one thousand. So I said, I said three fifty, or I can't remember what name, what number it was. I said fifteen, cause that's that's my birthday, birthday number. So I just picked that. Stupid me. I picked fuck. I picked fifteen. Um, waited, waited, waited. I didn't get in the tournament, but luckily she passed around again, and I entered again, and my brother also entered, and I said three fifty, and he said five. 550, 555, I can't remember. Yeah, and I didn't go and he went in. But yeah, that's a whole other story that he wants to talk about. Maybe. So yeah, I'll let him talk about it. But yeah, anyways, it was a great experience. Uh, first midnight release, so it was really fun, really cool. Anyway, let's talk about this gameplay. Let's talk about the difference between Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2 and a little bit of Black Ops. Well, here's my take on it Black Ops. On Black Ops, uh, you get to sit back more. For me, you sit back more. You like camp a little bit more. There's cover there, so you have to wait there and just like see where everybody's going and stuff. So it's pretty easy to go with. Mono for two, it's more gun to gun battle. You gotta run in, but a little bit more bullshit. If you ask me, yeah, it was ri ridiculous. What kills they got and stuff, but yeah, it was still okay. And then you got Mono for three. A model for three is different. The maps are way smaller. Like not way smaller, but the medium maps are like all basically all these maps there are no large maps for me. There are no large maps. There's just medium, 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 medium. I don't I look at that, there's a new kill streak or point streak that I am at, which are like bouncing beddies. Four bouncing beddies you put right there and then once they walk by they just pop up. Boom! Destroyed, blown up. Anyways, uh, there it is. You see it? Yeah, once they walk by it, pff, dead. Anyway, uh, Modern for 3 and Modern for 2, are they the same? Yes, uh, I think they are relatively similar. They are the same, the gameplay is the same, so who should I say should buy this? Uh, if you don't like Modern for 3, don't buy it, look at that, nice job, yeah, 7 kill streak, booyah. Uh, if you don't like Modern for 2, well, I don't think you should buy Modern for 3, it's the same gameplay, just different maps, different gun. And same, same thing, different day. You know, like and yeah, you just sorry, I got a little bit off track there. But yeah, so if you don't like Model for Two, don't get it. You like Model for Two or the just Call of Duty series in general, then I definitely think you should pick up this game. Uh, the point system, a point streak system, is like the kill streak. But for some reason, for me, I find the point streak system way long. Like for some reason, it takes longer to get those things. I don't know if that's just me, but if it is, hey, whatever. But yeah, they take longer. Now there's two different sets. You could get the assault one, which has like all the weaponry stuff, like the IMS, the attack helicopter, the predator missile, and the juggernaut, the assault juggernaut with the machine gun. I'm guessing, and a, a bunch of stuff that can kill people. Now the support is different. Uh, you just get like UAVs, counter UAVs, advanced UAVs, things that benefit your team. And the difference between those two is that when you die in the support system, the support 
point streak, you don't lose it. You don't like lose your streak. Like an assault streak, which is like the regular kill streak. If you die, you have to restart. But with the support streak, you don't restart. You just keep on going. And that's basically what it is. Um, I played the new game types, uh, Kill Confirm. I think Kill Confirm is great. It's fun. It's the new game mode that they added. It's really fun. Shoot the guy, pick up the dog tags. Basically, there's like no camping in it. That's the way I feel. Kill so many people get the, kill, uh, the dog tags, which is cool. And I haven't played Team Defender yet. I'm waiting for my like squad, my clan. One shot. That's, that's what my clan name is. Well, clan. Uh, our clan name is. One shot. Waiting for them to go on. Play some Team Defender and just wave everyone there. And yeah, I can't wait for this uh, new game time. And I played a little bit of Spec Ops. Just a Spec Ops mission. I'm going to play Survival Mode possibly uh, during this week. Uh, and yeah, it's gonna be fun. And I played the campaign. The campaign is incredible. Don't worry, I'm not gonna spoil it for you guys who haven't played it yet. But it's incredible. If you've been following the the storylines from each of them, Mom for one, it was good. Mom for two, it was good. Mom for three, I think it's a great ending to the series, and it's just incredible. I I absolutely loved it. It's epic. And yeah. Yeah, um, I think Modern for Call of Duty is a great way to play with your team, so that's why I'm waiting for Team Defender to open up, so I can, oh, it's open, but I want to play with my team so we can win. Now, what guns do I use? I use this Scar with the Silencer, I think it's a great gun, it's pretty beast. I'm, I'm looking to unlock the ACR though, um, I like that gun more for 2, so I'm going to try using Modern for 3, and yeah. So this game is just all out fun. As you can see how I'm raping people left and right. Just trying to hope for the best, trying to get the best uh what Oh shit! Ah God damn it! Fuck that blinded me. Whew. Alright. So yeah, and I'm not the best Call of Duty player as I'm saying as you can see right now. Some people will probably get way better than me. I know there's some people right there out there saying yeah, my, I'm better than you. One on one, it's a quick scope. You know who you are. And, yeah. I just can't wait to tell my friends to get this. Uh, hopefully, some of you guys can send me some messages to play with you guys if you watch this. And, look at that, me capping the B flag like a boss. And, uh, let's see, what else should I talk about? Um, all along, I think this is a fun game. Uh, by far this is my favorite map though, not just because I got a good gameplay on this, no, it's just because I just like the way it's structured, structured like, you can see me getting a death stream right now, I just like this map, it's uh, really fun, the worst map is this one map, I don't remember the name of it, but it's like, I forgot to touch my controller, turn black, you know, I'll go to sleep like that, forgot to touch it, um, yeah, so, I recommend you guys buy this game if you didn't like Modern for 2. Actually, just go ahead and buy it. It's just really fun. It's like a start of a new game, basically, for me. And, yeah. Uh, this game's about to wrap up. What i like to thank people. This is what I'd like to thank because a lot of words have been going out in school with my friends. I like to thank my friends, uh, the people who watch this, and yeah, there's the end of it. People who watch this, please just uh, make a just subscribe to me uh, comment suggestion do whatever you want look at this jocks 23 perfect name look at that guy's like holy shit boom great final kill and yeah I go I go 34 and 14 not bad but if you guys think you could do good then go ahead so yeah thanks and subscribe see you guys later